We're just gonna have fun today. We'll get serious into goals and hard stuff later on, but today. Tomorrow. To, no, not tomorrow, no. <laughs> it's, we just turned 2023. Let's, you know, we're not. Good morning, everyone, once again, and happy new year, 2020, 2023. I have one question for everyone out there. Should I shave my beard or should I keep going through January? What do you think? Getting a lot of conflicting reviews. 2020, new year, new goals, lots to talk about. Let's get to the pool for our very first training session slash morning swim of the new year. We are in the middle of the first week of January here in Indiana, and it is in the 60s. In the 60s. You never know what you're gonna get here. <laughs> Last week, it was 10 degrees and we had snow, and now, basically shorts and t-shirt weather. <laughs> All swimmers know that amazing feeling when you walk into a warm pool in the morning, that air hits your skin, the chlorinated air, the smell, you know, it's in your bones. If you've been a swimmer, you you know. Conflicting emotions. Number one, it's a little bit comforting. Number two, it reminds you of the pain before you. That's gonna make you stronger, gonna make you better, you know, but yeah. I haven't been here in a few weeks because this pool has been closed for cleaning. Yeah, just, it's comforting to be back, you know? And duty number one this morning is throw these lane lines in the pool. Even Olympic gold medalists help with lane lines. That's right. Everyone, part of the ship, part of the crew, baby. To be clear, I'm not talking about myself, I'm talking about right there. A you, right there. Lots of stuff to look forward to. First training session back, so we're gonna have a good time. We're gonna swim with Lily today. I haven't swam with Lily in almost a month now, so we're just gonna have a good time today. Gonna work hard. Let's see what the doctor's orders are this morning. I'm sure Coach Corey wrote us a good one for the middle distance group today. Lily left her stuff in Florida. Oops. It's like she's never done this before. Really hoping Coach Yusuf has it. Coach Yusuf will have it. Uh, Yusuf and I are gonna swim together this week. I haven't seen him in a while either. Um, all right, got the workout. It's, uh, oh, oh, hang on. I'm gonna flash it up right there. Lily, you still in the shot? Right there. There it is. Good. <laughs> Gonna go long today. Good aerobic -y swimming with some 25s fast. I need to go get some socks. Yeah, get some socks. Probably my, my biggest pet peeve in the whole world, that right there, loose lane lines. Can't do it, can't do it, not good. I was a victim of the Southwest Airlines 5,000 flight cancellations. At least you weren't at your destination already. That's true, and we didn't go to the airport. We knew we were gonna get canceled, so, you know, could have been worse, but anyway. I almost lost my leg this Christmas. What happened? To a bee sting. Oh yeah, she sent me a photo, it was nasty. Is it still there? Is it gone? It's, it's getting better, it's out of bed. It's, it's pretty we'll much gone. No, you don't, you don't need to see that, oh, but she, uh, are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> Here we go, 10 seconds. The countdown has begun. People are looking nervous. <laughs> I haven't swam since last year. Good one, Josh, good one. <laughs> All right, go, ready, go, go. All right, clear the runway, Lily. Coach Corey turned on all our giant TVs for us. Thank you, Coach. Oh. It's been a minute since I've shared a lane with the recently crowned world champion, Lily King. She did it. Lily, she did it. Coming off another, well, first short course world championship title. And now she in just needs, in the 100 breaths. Yeah, we gotta get specific. Okay. <laughs> now she just needs to chill for a little while. Just kind of, you know, turn your brain off. Don't think too much. Have fun, goof off with people like me. You know, don't take things too seriously. That's important sometimes. Am I, am I hitting the nail on the head? I think, I think so. We're just gonna have fun today. We'll get serious into goals and hard stuff later on, but today. Tomorrow. To, no, not tomorrow, no. <laughs> it's, we just turned 2023. Let's, you know, we're not those people that are like, all right, new year, gotta do this, 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 this. No, no, no. Trials isn't until the end of June. Yeah. So the college kids are ramping up, but. We're kind of just We've there. got like five months until the next big, till world championship trials for long course world championships. There's some meets, but 
playtime. Let's just call it playtime. We missed the interval. We missed it. <laughs> oh, God. Coach Corey just asked me if I would do a 50 mile trail run. That's Not swim, little, run. That's a little intense. Do you think I could do it? Uh, no, no. I mean, it's five months away. <laughs> no, no faith. No one has any faith in me. That's a really long way. Wow. No one has any faith in me, man. Keep in mind, I did just get Allie a very nice treadmill at home, which I've been using in preparation for my triathlon training. However, the most I've ever run is like 13 miles, not a super fast pace. But last week I ran about 25 miles in total. You know I have a treadmill, I've been training. I've been, uh, I've been running. Okay, all right, fine, 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 fine. No face. But maybe, may I gotta go, I'm missing it. I mean, that would be not just one, but two marathons. I've never even done one. I don't know, this is, that's months away. That's future Cody problems, but it's in the back of my brain. Because Coach put it there. The furthest you can go with no training is you can do a marathon. I don't think you can do 50. But I, am, I have marathon been, the thing is I have been training. I've been running almost every day. Not a lot, but you know, four or five miles a day. That's not nothing. I think you're doing what we in the King family call mistaking motion for achievement. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. All right, all right. Might be a little harder than we're giving it credit. Two marathons in a row. I don't know. It's I don't. Know. I like to think, you know, willpower over everything, right? <laughs> Got relocated to Breeze Lane for the main for the main set. <laughs> I'm gonna flash it up again for you guys right there. Mm -hmm. uh, it's interesting. It's, I'm gonna I'm gonna pull them to victory today. That's the plan. Pull, give these girls a nice draft, make it easy, get through the 300s, get through the 200s, make the interval on the ladder half stuff right. Th you know, it's gonna be good. Yeah, th yeah, we are gonna have a good. That's right. Thank you, Cabrilla. The attitude in this lane, top notch. Josh, I see you eyeballing me underwater. Looking me head to toe. Oh yeah. I see it. Oh, the 300, that's kind of far. Yeah. Let's do that again. Let's go again, you know? Goodness. At the end of each round, we got a 50 all underwater fast. You get a breath at the flip turn down at the end. That's it. Here we go, Josh. Uh, three weeks, maybe? It's getting pretty thick. Should I, I shave it? I feel like all of a sudden it's just there. Well, you haven't seen me in a few weeks. Yeah. I think I might keep it for a little while. Okay, a little no shave one each Yeah, sure. What do you think? Should I keep the beard? Josh, should I keep the beard? Yeah. You like the beard? Good job. Oh, well done. Good job. Not a bad way to start the year. That was good. Oh yeah. All right, let's chit chat on my way out of here, shall we? Goals for the new year. Obviously, race at US Nationals at the Nat in Indy, my favorite pool this summer, but that's like five months away. I wanna do a triathlon. I haven't done one since I was in high school, so that's on the list. Maybe a running race. I know we were joking earlier about the 50 mile trail run, but like Coach Corey is actually gonna do that, and I have actually been doing a fair amount of running, so I don't know about doing that one that long, but anyway, so something like that. Personal goals, I wanna to continue to make an impact, especially in this swimming world, which is one of the reasons why I love doing swim clinics. So I have a goal of doing two swim clinics a month, or roughly that, because I get so much gratification out of helping young athletes, meeting people, some of the people that watch these videos, that's incredibly fun. I have competition goals, relationship goals, trying to be the best dad possible. I'm gonna do a whole video where we, where we dive into this stuff and we, we talk about this kind of stuff. Anyway, I am extremely hungry, so let's head home and take a quick minute to talk about the sponsor of this video. Today's video is sponsored by one of my absolute favorites, maybe my favorite. Factor. Factor has become my absolute go-to dinner or lunch plan, especially on really hectic, busy, 
training days. I still use HelloFresh as well. HelloFresh actually owns Factor. I love cooking meals. You know, we like to have family meal night, but also the convenience of on-the-go meals with Factor. With 34 chef-prepared, dietitian-approved weekly options, there's always something new to try. They've also got all kinds of awesome add-ons. I am personally a big fan of the smoothies. If you're looking to cut back on takeout, which is something that I have struggled with in the past, get Factor instead. Not only is Factor cheaper than takeout, but meals are ready quicker than restaurant delivery in just two minutes. This year, achieve and maintain your goals with Factor. Get America's number one ready to eat meal kit and start saving time, eating well, and living your best life. I love the flexibility. I can add meals at any time, pause or skip a delivery week if I'm going out of town. Head to go.factor75.com slash Cody60 to get 60% off your first Factor Box. That's 60% off your first Factor Box with my code Cody60, link down there. First training day of the new year, 2023 is done. I have a lot of exciting stuff coming up this year. Lots of big events, lots of goals, a lot of stuff. We'll dive into that in my next video, but until then, make sure you're following me online. If you'd like a personalized video from me to you or someone you know, for whatever reason, I am on Cameo. We have just a few t-shirts and hoodies left from the winter water drop line after the restock when it when it sold out so there's just a few there you can check that stuff out on merch store I am doing clinics and swim sessions here at my home pool if you'd like to book me for a club for a swim team firing fire I uh, can't speak fire me an email to Cody Miller show at gmail.com just ask for clinic information and I've been doing lots of private one-on-one -on -one training sessions in my home endless pool and that has been so much fun, like so rewarding for me to actually help people get better, learn, improve their tech, all those kinds of things. So if you want information on that, once again, send me an email there. All right, everyone, that's it. I hope that you are off to a good start on this new year and until my next video, I will see you later.